The ocean provides vast and dynamic habitat for hundreds of thousands of plants and animals that interact with one another in complex interconnected webs. As ocean scientists, it is our responsibility to investigate their roles and relationships in the marine environment and provide the sound scientific evidence in order to implement successful protection of these systems. We strive to understand the critical connections that humans have with marine environments and most importantly, the impacts of our actions on them. Studying any organism, you need to look at how that organism is connected, not only to the other individuals of that population or species, but also the other species in the environment, as well as physical factors in the environment. Humans have a huge impact on their environment. Anything that we do is like to lead to influence organisms. We are a collective of students, faculty, researchers, and volunteers. The Coastal Marine Institute Laboratory provides us a tool to study unique ecological habitats and environmental problems spanning the California coast and, and beyond. We are located on San Diego Bay, and our 50,000 square foot facility allows us the ability to perform basic and applied coastal research while providing interdisciplinary solutions to environmental and ecological problems. The urbanized setting of our lab allows us a unique perspective in understanding the threats faced by coastal and marine communities, both locally and worldwide. The Coastal Marine Institute Laboratory serves faculty and students in the College of Sciences and elsewhere within San Diego State University. Currently, most of the research is being conducted through the Department of Biology and more specifically through the ecology program. Although the laboratory has been open since only 2006, marine science at SDSU reflects a long history of excellence. Along with five resident marine ecology faculty, about 20 graduate students and several undergraduates work at the marine lab in any given year. Importantly, because of the lab's urban location, that allows us to focus on both basic and applied issues in marine science. Our goal is to continue to build infrastructure, uh, provide opportunities for students and faculty to conduct more research, and to involve the broader research community and the public. We seek to provide excellence in research and education in ecology and environmental biology with the ultimate goal of providing the best possible education to the next generation of scientists through research, teaching, mentorship, and service. In collaboration with local institutions, our research interests span from conservation ecology, coastal marine ecology, global climate change, and ecosystem ecology. Such a diverse focal area has allowed our students to pursue successful careers in academia, independent consulting, government, and non-governmental organizations. The facility is, is really built, in my mind, to serve two main purposes. One of those is to provide facilities for working with live marine organisms. The other thing that's done at the Coastal Marine Institute Laboratory is to provide a staging area for research that occurs in the field. And sometimes that's going out and just collecting samples, bringing them back to the laboratory and analyzing them. So we took viral and bacterial samples and now we're working on analyzing the microbial diversity and function analysis. I research Eastern Pacific Green Sea Turtles in San Diego Bay and that research is made possible by uh, the facilities of the Coastal Marine Institute and Laboratory. Not only do we use the facility for boat storage, but to store and refurbish our equipment that we use. We use the computers at the facility to make our receivers ready to go and be deployed out in the field and so uh, our research really wouldn't be possible without it. There are other lab-based projects going on where students keep organisms alive for long periods of time in the lab and are able to study how particular factors of interest like temperature or sound or pollution might impact these organisms. The marine lab provides a, an, a venue for making really close connections between students and between faculty. As the next generation of ecologists, conservationists, and marine scientists, we are not only motivated to perform novel experiments on the forefront of ecological research, but to share our knowledge and passions with our community. We build relationships through science and education and encourage our partners to explore their roles as scientists, conservationists, and stewards of the environment.
Our role as scientists in the community is to collaborate with other scientists and to pass along our knowledge to the community. We gain new information and answer uh, new questions about our environment. There's this immediate connection where we're bringing local students in, exposing them to local science, and then they provide this immediate connection to um, their families and, and the local um, populace in the area. So I think that that's really critical. We are all connected. As scientists and members of the global community, we are connected to each other and also to the natural world around us. To ensure a healthy relationship with our environment, we strive to better understand the ocean, its resources, and inhabitants. To find out more about academic programs and research projects at the Coastal Marine Institute, please visit us at www.sci.sdsu.edu forward slash CMI. We hope that you will connect with us. We are fully committed to garnering a sustainable relationship with marine ecosystems for generations to come.